Ty Campbell at Tekken Racing. Today we're going to talk about the setting active brake or active braking, specifically how you can use it on the racetrack, what it actually does, and how to adjust it on the hot wire. So what does active brake actually accomplish? It's actually very easy. I'm going to use my buggy just to show you exactly what it does. I like to call active brake panic brake. Basically, it is a really strong pulse of brake that you can adjust how strong that pulse is when you snap to full brakes. So if you come off of a jump, car's nose high, and you want to be able to bring the nose down really quickly, that's where this active brake setting is gonna help you. You can snap full brakes. It's gonna freeze the wheels and give you a stronger brake pulse than what your brakes are actually set for and help bring the nose of the vehicle down. Think of active brake as more of a secondary brake setting. It's really not all that important, but it is there if you want to use it. So the default for active brake is actually off. We don't set any of it in the ESC when you do a factory reset, when it comes out of the box or reflash the firmware. There are zero to six steps, six being the maximum, and the higher you set the slider, the stronger active brake strength you're going to have. So the active brake is actually only available on the RS and RSX line of ESCs. The RX4 and the RX8 don't have it, and it's only programmable through the hot wire. So let's go plug into the hot wire real quick. And we'll check out how to adjust active brake. With the ESC plugged into the hot wire, we have access to all available settings, and active brake is located on the brake tab. It's going to be the second setting from the right-hand side, right next to RPM brake and brake minimum. The default is zero and you have one to six for your adjustment range. Now, the higher up you set the slider, the more aggressive the active brake action is gonna be. Keep in mind, this doesn't adjust any other braking strengths or settings. This is only going to activate when you snap to full brakes aggressively. So once we have a setting that we like, we wanna apply the settings and hit okay to save them to the ESC.